This is my second pen tester, so we're going to be doing three things on this one. The first one is going to be how to get rid of stretch marks. Everyone has that problem, mostly girls. But basically what you're going to need is egg whites from two eggs, uh, and you're supposed to whip it up nice and gently. Now it didn't tell me like how it's supposed to look or the thickness of it, so I just did it like where it started foaming almost. So, I mean, I can still technically continue doing it. But, that would take a while because they said to do it gently. That's all they gave me, so I didn't even use a mixture. I just kind of started hand doing it. But what you're supposed to do is just to take it and put it on your stretch marks. Anywhere that you have stretch marks, and it's supposed to, um, like, tighten your skin and everything. And then after it dries, I believe, yeah, after it dries, you're supposed to run it through, you know, special washer, wherever it's at, with water, and then you're supposed to put oil on. Like, it says to put olive oil on, but I'm not going to put olive oil. I'm going to put my Gold Bond Rough and Bumpy Skin Daily tr uh, Therapy Cream, because it's made for real quick. So. Fast forward it, but I'm going to push this mitt back, and I'm going to put it on my trouble areas. Now, the reason why I'm doing this is because... I, I used to work out a lot, so I had bigger thighs when I used to work out. And since I stopped working out, I have stretch marks from not having the muscles anymore. So, I'm going to do that real quick. You probably won't be able to see it fully because the zoom doesn't go any further up. So, I'm going to do that real quick and fast forward it. Okay, now that that's nice and filthy, I'm gonna put this down over here. I'm gonna wash my hands okay. really quick. Okay, the next one is something a little bit different. I've never tried. This one's for blackheads. This is to take half a slice of lemon. Here, let me pull this back. Half a slice of lemon and like three or four droplets of honey. Same one I showed you guys in my last one. So let's do three or four droplets. One, two, three, four. Well, that wasn't really droplets, but it should be close enough. And what it says is you're supposed to rub it all over your problem areas. So like your nose, your chin, and your T-zone. I don't have blackheads really like up here or down here. I have blackheads like right here in my T-zone. So I'm gonna use my handy dandy mirror and I'm gonna do that. Oh god, it smells so oh it's going everywhere guys. <laughs> this better work. Alright guys. Now you're supposed to leave it on for five minutes. It's getting all over my face. Exactly. So I have my handy dandy phone. Oh. And I'm gonna calculate, okay. Now, the last thing this last, next to waiting for all of this to dry and tell you the results, is getting an orange peel. You don't need a really big one. This lemon is going down into my mouth. Mm, lemon and honey is not that bad together. But um yeah, just get an orange peel, and it says use the white side, and you're supposed to use it on your teeth. This is to make your teeth like super, super white, apparently. Now, my teeth aren't white. I have that natural yellow teeth. Like, I've tried almost everything, and it just stays yellow. So let's try this.
My teeth feel cleaner. But in all perspective, do I think they look like whiter? I don't, I don't see anything. I guess a tad bit. I guess they kind of do look like they're a little bit cleaner, a tad bit. Wow, I kind of, yeah. Now that I do it more, I kind of just. I'm still getting that lemon memo. Still so, yeah. getting. giving me a sparkling shine now but it did make my teeth slightly wider so I'm kind of confused whether or not I should give that a fail or a win I would have to say they look a tad bit wider so it works to an extent maybe if you have to do it every single day it will work fully so I'm gonna give this a pin win because this kind of worked so if you want to try that teeth whitening method just get an orange peel and use the white side and just rub it all over your teeth. That should work. My teeth feel smooth now. Now the egg thing is all dry and I still got two more minutes for this. So I'm going to transition you to after all of that. So see you guys about five minutes after I just tested these things. Okay, so for the egg uh, stretch mark thing, it didn't work. Not even one faded. Nothing worked when it came to that. So, that's a pin fail. There's, it didn't work. It didn't work at all. As a matter of fact, even after putting my lotion on, I feel like my legs are really sticky and disgusting. I even jumped in the shower to scrub it off in hopes that that would help prevent this, the stickiness. And it's still a little bit sticky. So, I wouldn't really recommend it, but if you want to try it for yourself and see if it works for you, you go ahead and try it. I'm not going to stop you. Now, for the next one, the nose thing. The only thing that I noticed is it definitely feels smoother, but none of my blackheads have gone away. Matter of fact, I didn't see any noticeable difference other than this. It's a bit smoother, and that's about it. So maybe <laughs> what it could be used for is... Um, uh, putting it on and then after you wash it off after about you know five minutes you can uh, put a nose strip on and maybe that will help just take all the shit off but other than that it made my rest of my face all nice and sticky so both both of those product projects have made my face very very sticky so <laughs> that's also in my opinion a pin fail so I hope you guys enjoyed the three pins I just did um, if you still want to try them, you go on ahead. I cannot guarantee if they will work for you or if they don't work for the, for you because everyone has their own bodies. They react differently. So, who knows? Maybe it'll work perfectly for you. Maybe your stretch marks will be disappeared and you're the lucky one. So, just try it out yourself if you want to. Have a good fun night. Like, oh, I want to try a whole bunch of shit out tonight. Well, there you go. I got a whole list of things for you. So if you'd like me to continue doing these Pinterest things, just like below and leave me a comment or subscribe. And if you want me to try anything particular, go ahead and tell me below also and I will happily try it just for you. Alright, so see you later guys!